Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be part one of four Timu hauls. So I really hope you enjoy watching today's video and if you're interested in what I got then just continue to watch. <laughs> So hi guys, if you're new here, welcome. My name is Juliet, and I do new videos on this channel every week, as long as the kids aren't at home. I do lots of beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and hauls. So if that's the kind of thing you're interested in, there is a little subscribe button down there in red somewhere. I would love for you to click that and stick around. It's completely free and entirely up to you. And if you're one of my lovely subscribers, thank you so much for coming back. Your support is very much appreciated as always. But without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So today's video is kindly sponsored by Timu. I'm sure you have heard of them by now. They are literally storming social media and the internet and the amount of products that they sell is incredible. There are thousands to choose from, like thousands. You were there all day and they offer products up to 90% off like what you would pay anywhere else. So a lot of the things you'll find are almost identical to what you see on like Amazon, but they are just kind of cutting out the middleman and yeah, there's some great deals to be had. So Timu have kindly given me a discount code which I will leave here and you're going to get be able to get money off and also a hundred pounds worth of vouchers with that code. Now I am going to speak to Timu because I want to see if I can get a code for existing users as well because I know so many of you have already purchased through their app which is incredible. If you haven't before I will tell you this because I didn't realise this when I did my last video but the code is available to new users and you have to use it within 30 minutes of signing up and downloading the app. So I didn't realise this and now I know the best thing to do is browse first because you are going to be on there a lot longer than 30 minutes. Pick what you want and then download the app and then use the code because I'll give you the best savings. But I will speak to them and see if I can get another code and if I do I will make sure I link it in the description box below. So today is going to be a fashion haul because I thought I would do a fashion haul, an electronics, a beauty haul and then home organization haul because there was just so much on there I thought it would split it into four videos for you so everything I talk about I'm going to link below somebody actually commented on my last video and said please put prices the reason I haven't put prices when I'm talking through these products is for the reason of the savings if you sign up you will get it way cheaper than like what I will see that price at so the best thing for me to do is leave the links and the size that I got below and then you can click on and see what deal you can get the first thing I wanted to show you is I picked up a few bags from Timu. I actually had a really nice one in my last haul, which is like more of a going out um, clutch slash shoulder bag. And so I knew that the bags were incredible. And I saw a couple on there that I just had to get. So the first one is this bum bag, or they call them in America fanny packs, I believe. Um, I have one of these in like a white leather and I wear it all the time. But I wanted one that I could wear for the gym, something that is a little bit more um, casual. So I picked this up because I thought this could be for the gym, but also it's actually quite nice to wear on an everyday. It's black with all this gold hardware and it's got so much storage in it. So it's got a front pocket here which you can see it's got a bigger pocket at the back which has got so much room in it and then it's also got a little inside pocket as well it's completely adjustable and then it's just got your clip on now the one I've got at the moment I love it but it's a buckle and it's a pain to be honest getting it on and off so yeah I love this one and I can't wait, wait to you start using that I think it'll be perfect for autumn this year so still on those bags, I got this. This is one of the best little bags ever. If you are a fellow dog owner um, or you go on any walks, this is so, so cool, right? So it's actually marketed as a dog bag as well. It's got this little drawstring pocket on the top, which is on the strap is inside, um, which is perfect. They do say to put treats in, but it's big enough to put so much stuff inside. Like there's lots of room in there. It comes with a strap 
but this is what is incredible right it's got this little pocket on the front with a little poo bag dispenser i mean is that not just the most incredible thing if you walk dogs you will understand how good this is and i love that they got it in like this nice gray color because this i think would be perfect for me and matt so i will just fill it up and leave it by the door you can put his i can put samson's lead in there and stuff and so if anybody has animals and they go on dog walks i think these are incredible and it's nice and unisex for me and both for both me and matt to use the final bag that I picked up is actually one that I was really excited about coming. I saw these advertised on TikTok shop, but this one was so much more reasonably priced that I had to pick it up. And it is this gorgeous over the shoulder bag. So, or crossbody bag. It comes with the little strap in there. It's got all gold hardware on, which I love. It's got a big pocket on the front there and got a second big pocket. And this big pocket in the middle has got, um, a couple of card slots in it's got one there that you could probably put a driving license in. it's got a window in it um, and then also it's got this card like divider here but there's so much room inside and then what's the best bit about this which is the re one of the main reasons i got it is it on the third pocket at the back you can put your phone in so i'm going to pop mine in now zip it up you can then use your phone through the actual bag. So you can use it through it, which means you don't have to get your phone out of your bag. So when it sits against you, your phone is concealed. And then if like, you get a message or anything, you can read it and click into your phone and stuff without actually taking it out, which I think is so good if you are going out and you don't want to have like, risk having your phone stolen. I know my sister lives in London and she's forever saying like she, she never holds her phone because of pickpockets and things like that so this would be so so good because you literally would be able to just keep your phone in there and use it while it's in the bag so i loved that i thought that was such a good idea so this is it with the strap on it's obviously adjustable so you can wear it crossbody but how cute is that like i said i did it in loads of different colors i might actually get this in black as well because I just think it's really functional, really easy to wear, and then again, really safe having that phone feature on the back. Okay, and then the last kind of, I wouldn't say they're accessory, but they're these slippers. How beautiful are these slippers? Now, I saw these and I was like, I need those in my life because they've got this big chunky sole on the bottom like how cute is that sole it's really soft and really thick and foamy but then this is so fluffy and soft and it's kind of got this edge around it as well so your foot really fits snug in there these are a little bit big i did size up i think i got like the four and a half to five because i'm i'm actually a three and a half to four um and i probably could have got my size they are true to size um but i loved them they're kind of like like the really chunky flip-flops that you can get right now but slipper version and yeah i love them so so much and they would be a perfect gift for christmas as well actually i would highly recommend these okay next up i've got this dress to show you now i actually got this dress from timu i bought it in like a coffee color like a brown and i loved it so so much but it was a little bit big so i've actually bought it in gray and it's this material is just so soft and comfortable i've worn the brown one loads it's like a ribbed material but it's fleecy it's just such a beautiful comfortable material i got this in a medium this time because i bought it in a large last time and it was a little bit big like under the arms i still wear it loads but i thought i would get the gray one as well because i thought this is beautiful for the summer months but also i'm thinking like for the winter if you wore this with like some biker boots and a leather jacket i think that would also be really nice for autumn like a really nice transitional dress that one because i love that material so much and the colour of the so this was the colour of that dress that I got but I saw this little set and I thought I'm gonna get that because again it's another really nice autumn outfit when it gets a bit cooler not that we've had any warm weather but these are little cycling shorts they again that same like ribbed material I got this in a medium also 
so these are the shorts and then the top is like like a long line t-shirt with these slits up the side i really liked that because i think it makes them just gives a little bit something extra and it's also a little bit more flattering but i really loved the simplicity of this outfit i thought the t-shirt and the shorts but then in this really beautiful like brown fleecy material i thought again would be so lovely for the autumn Another little set that I got on there because I do love the sets on Timu, I have to say. I bought quite a few from them in the last haul I did with them. But I picked up this little, like it's kind of, it is to wear out, but I like this as loungewear. So you've got these little shorts, they have got pockets and they're this like really nice waffle material. They are so soft. The tie actually works as well, which is always a bonus. But these are the shorts and then to go with it, it's this little like tank top cropped tank top and again i said like i say it's really nice like autumnal colors but can you imagine on um, with like these slippers just like being cozy in the house i just really liked this and because it's technically you could wear this out it's just something like that you could lounge around and then if you've got to pop out to the shops it's just something nice and easy to wear perfect for the summer if you were to have one <laughs> yeah so i picked that up and i also got this in a medium since it's around set still i thought i would just quickly show you this pair of pajamas because i always buy pajamas when i do a haul i live in pajamas i probably own more pajamas than anything else but when i did my last timo haul i actually bought these pajamas with the blue flowers i've had so many people compliment them like my postman like even when they come it's like oh your pajamas are nice my mom loves them my friends love them they are so super comfortable that i got them with the pink flowers now the fabric is tiny bit different like the blue ones are definitely a lot more cottony whereas these are like more of a shiny material but I still absolutely love them like the ditzy print on there these are the pink flowers you get a pair of shorts I got these in a large by the way I always size up in my pajamas I hate feeling restricted when I sleep the top is just a matching t-shirt but I thought this was just so pretty I really love the print I love the simplicity of it and it's so nice and cool to sleep in so yeah really love that pajama set so much so a lot of the things that I've bought are very basic so I've bought this also got this pair of shorts now the reason being I actually bought some shorts very similar to this from home bargains um, and I really wanted another color but they only had pink and um, so I had these on Timo I was like I'm gonna get those so these are like a really nice jersey cotton material they've got a tie waist that works and then they've got like these pleats down the front of the short legs they've got nice deep pockets and they're just really lightweight so i think it's always nice to have a good pair of jersey shorts i've actually worn them um quite a lot season shall we say um so yeah it's really nice to have a black pair as well okay so next i actually bought two um sport items because i do love buying like the fitness clothes and this one may seem very familiar to you because this sports bra i actually bought from timu myself last time it has got all these crisscrosses on the back it is such a stunning sports bra i loved it that much but it was a tiny bit too big in fact I have it on I actually have it on and um, today you can see let me just unbutton this you can see what I mean like this one is like quite gapy here and so I can't really wear this to the gym because it's just not very supportive at all so that was a large and I picked it up in a medium and it is so so much better I love this sports bra I wear it all the time with like tie-dye leggings I think having a nice white one and a nice black one you can just switch out your bottoms um but yeah loved this got it in a medium it's really good quality really thick really supportive it's got like double straps at the top can't recommend this one enough and it's got the removable pads in there as well funnily enough i actually had a fabletic sports bra very very similar to this for my birthday and that one is actually really see-through um and it hasn't got pads in it so i have to steal pads out of like these bras to put in my fabletics one so yeah really recommend these also on the sportswear i wanted to try and get leggings as close to my fabletics ones as possible to kind of just compare and see what they were like so these have turned up and they're actually really nice they are the buttery same buttery soft material as my fabletics are they have got all the same like seams that my fabletics ones have and then they also have the phone pockets as well which is awesome um 
the only thing that's different is the actual elasticated waistband in like fabletics the whole waistband is elasticated if that makes sense whereas like you can feel you can feel the elastic in this like it's like a round the waist so we will see i will compare and see how they are um but yeah i got these in a medium because my fabletics ones are in a medium as well but like i say they have all the same lines they feel very similar and they've got the pockets so we'll see how we get on let's see if they're squat proof as well okay just some feedback on these black leggings okay I probably should have got the small because there's quite a bit of giving in them um, and so I don't feel as sucked in and they're not 100% tight around my ankles. The elasticated waist, I did think this might be not a problem but can you see how you can still see my mum top? Now I am pretty bloated to be fair because time of the month um, but with my Fabletics the whole panel is elasticated so it would normally suck this in I'm feeling very bloated at the moment. Yeah, it would normally suck this in, whereas because the elastic is literally only at this top bit, it doesn't hold me in as much. But, but, they do feel lovely. Um, squat proof. Uh, I'll be able to tell you when I watch that footage back, because <laughs> the ring light will definitely, I've put underwear on, on just to 100% check that. Um, but they feel really nice, actually. I definitely would wear them to the gym um, and this sports bra so glad I got it in my size because it fits like a dream and I love it it's so beautiful I'm definitely gonna get this in another color while I'm just doing this gym try on section I actually wanted to show you this because I completely forgot to show you that I actually bought a gym bag as well and this was so reasonably priced but I needed a gym bag because Leo has robbed my red one my red Nike one um, and I just wanted something plain and simple I love this black with the gold hardware and it had loads of different like sections which I loved um, and it's got like this waterproof pocket on the front if you go swimming and you've got to put anything wet in there and then it comes with the um, strap as well which like I say it's got the gold hardware on so I'm just gonna pop it on to show you one thing that I love about it is the external pockets as well you just slide your phone and keys in when you're going from the car and also it's got the shoe side pocket as well um my old bag had this and it comes in so useful you literally just open that up and you can put your shoes in a separate compartment but yeah really loved this bag just nice and simple and it all double up for like a hold all as well if like you were going on holiday um it's got it's even got actually it's got the little thing on you know if you are putting it on top of your suitcase you can slide it over the handles so yeah that's another nice nice little um and it's got another side pocket here yeah really really pleased with that can't wait to start using that for the gym because i needed a new one so yeah if you're after a new gym bag i love that one so so much next up i bought a lovely summer dress now i don't know why because i don't know what's happening but apparently we're supposed to have some nice weather next week so maybe i'll get wear out of it yeah i love this because it's so stretchy which i think is perfect you know if you're going out you don't want anything to be too tight and restrictive but i just love the ditzy prints on this it's just this beautiful blue floral pattern and then this bit here like on the boob bit is like double layer so just gives an extra bit of coverage and yeah really really loved that one i thought this is such good quality and it wasn't very expensive at all so yeah hopefully i'll get to wear that this year if not it'll go away for next summer i love 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 this ditzy print dress it's so supportive but it's also with this ruche in here really flattering one thing i will say is the straps aren't adjustable that, that is my only criticism um, because I feel like I could do with a little bit of adjusting here like it feels a bit tight however um, it's lovely the ruche in here I love so so much and yeah love this dress next up I have got this now I bought one of these on my last haul but I made the mistake of buying my size and also one thing I really didn't like about these magic suits is the knicker line on them so whenever you wear these like sucky in 
kind of magic bodysuits that they're calling them you get like a pant line well this one is a thong version which i love the idea of it's also got really good clasps it's got the hook and eye which means that it's more secure and i find that they don't rub as much as well because when you get the press studs you get the horrible feeling of where like they're stitched on at the back but this one i actually bought in a small so i've bought this in a smaller size this is like an eight i think like a uk eight i mean it looks tiny i don't know whether i'm going to be able to get in that but it's got this tummy control here which is supposed to suck you in a size and be perfect for jeans so yeah i can't wait to try that let's hope i can get in this one but i've been told to get the size down and that's where the magic happens so i think we're just gonna have to cut away to the try on to see if that's right, right. okay it's a bodysuit time i thought i would do this fully on camera because um you want to see don't you whether it works or not so i have these motto jeans who remembers motto from top shop these while i've been losing weight have been my gold jeans um instead of going on the scales i've been going by a pair of jeans that i want to get back into so i am actually finally back into these jeans just and i'm going to show you what i mean by just like literally they just do up so i'm just gonna get into them and show you where i am so they do up <laughs> they do up she says the zip's a bit tight and i have got a little bit of room here already you can see that um but they are very snug at the front um, and i am a bit bloated at the moment so this is what these jeans look like um just thought that these would be the best jeans to see whether we do have any change here especially right now um so let's suit up i'm gonna get most of it on um but i'm gonna have to do it off on camera because obviously i gotta take my bra off with it so hold on a sec okay i'm not gonna lie i feel a bit bedraggled having to get that on um but it's on and i think you have to pull it down so it's like sucks in the hips as well because this panel is now right over my belly i think that's what it's supposed to be and it is a thong back but i'm not going to put my butt on the internet so anyway um we'll go again with the same jeans i have to say it's very supportive up the top it's got adjustable straps i have got the gusset on the tightest one um and i don't feel like it's um cutting me in half so that's good so that's a, a positive just making sure my butt isn't in the mirror behind me <laughs> that would be embarrassing wouldn't it okay so this is the small um i probably should have pointed to show you that these are the same jeans trust me i don't have two pairs of jeans like this right okay so Oh wow okay yeah the zip has gone up way easier look at that there is loads more room in that now can we see that has definitely pulled me in like i said i'm very bloated at the moment so i couldn't probably get these on normally comfortably um but yeah they don't feel tight at all the only thing that feels tight is the the suit but not uncomfortable tight definitely trimmed my waist that has so yeah that is my verdict if you want to try these you need to size down at least one size so i sized down to the small which said it was like six to eight i think um but look how much that cinched my waist in really impressed with that like you could wear this out as well because the coverage on the actual top is really nice so you could get away with just wearing this out yeah 
Yeah. Really pleased with that. Thumbs up for the bodysuit, eventually. I think I've tried about three now, but love this one. Love the thong back. Love the sucky in. Love the adjustable straps. Really like the top of this as well. So yeah, big thumbs up from me. Okay, so next up I wanted to try and get these because these seemed like a really, a really good bargain. And it was a three pack of these tops. I thought these would be perfect for all year round because you could wear them underneath things or you can like you can layer them. They're this really nice ribbed material. It's got a V neckline and then it's kind of just it's got like another bit of paneling down here like a sucky in kind of panel. But these are the colours. So you've got like this white colour. It's a little bit off white I would say. Then you get this gorgeous beige colour in there and then finally you get the black so you get these three coloured crop v-neck tops in a pack and they are such good quality like really good quality you would probably pay like almost 10 pounds for something like this in primark now so yeah really really pleased with these i got these in a medium just a quick feedback on the top i took the bra insets inserts out because it's actually double layered here so you can wear it without bra i find it's like not revealing at all and um, this bit isn't very elasticated it has got some elastic in it but not a lot but the fit is beautiful but with that boob insert thing in it just gave me the wrong shape so without it i'm much happier next up i bought a sweatshirt so i wanted to get just a plain sweatshirt just to look at the quality because the price was actually lower than a primark i think that's what i was thinking whenever i was looking at stuff i was thinking how much should this be in primark um to see how it fared up so this would have worked out cheaper and it's come and i actually really like it it's fleecy on the inside it's quite a shiny material like it doesn't feel like a cotton as such um i think i've got something else in this kind of like scuba -y material but it's 100 percent okay so it's 100 percent polyester that is why it's not cotton at all but it's a really nice soft sweatshirt and i love just like the plainness of these these would be really good if you needed to have like a uniform or you needed something for like staff to wear because they're reasonably priced and you could like print on these so it might be good for a startup business as well if you were looking to personalize um t-shirts and jumpers and things like that this jumper if i'm honest is the only thing i'm not that pleased about because it's just see how see-through it is it's just a really weird material you can, i've cut my white top underneath and you can see how like see-through the material is it's a bit weird feeling um I'd probably prefer a Primark jumper over this one, if I'm honest. I think it's a nice casual for the money. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't buy it again. Like, yeah, I just wouldn't. That's my honest opinion. Okay, the next two fashion items I have for you were a little bit of a do I, don't I? Because of the two things that I'm a bit wary when I buy online. First one being jeans i did it i bit the bullet i bought some jeans from timu and i am really pleased with them so far i've got to try them on and it'll show you in the cutaway now i did buy a medium which was a 10 and i was a little bit hesitant because i thought are they going to be too tight are they going to fit the waist does look pretty snug but we'll see how i get on but i loved these i love the simplicity they are just straight wide leg so they are just wide all the way down again very 90s these are um and then they've got just like the nice simple yellow thread like really levi vibes um but yeah really love those they feel really good quality denim actually as well so i hope that they fit nice i thought they might go nice with those tops that i've bought yeah just some feedback on these jeans love them by the way love 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 them and um, they fit really really nice but they are very long so I'm five foot four, I'm on my tiptoes right now and they're still scraping the floor on my very, very tiptoes. So yes, they are very long, but regards to the fit, they actually fit really nice. See, so yeah, I might just cut the bottoms off because they're a little bit long. 
And finally, I thought I'd get a more expensive item. And I thought I would go with a blazer. Now, I've bought blazers in the past from a lot of places online. And I never really... I'm never really happy with them. I always think they're not great quality. Um, they can be like really really thin not have a nice shape to them but this one i'm actually really really impressed now this one i think was around 28 30 pounds which to be fair is kind of the same price you would pay in primark but i loved the look of it they actually had this in pink which i was very close to getting because of the whole barbie fad at the moment but i thought you cannot go wrong with a nice simple white blazer now this one has got the gold detail so it's almost like a waffly material it's got the gold button detail it's got the buttons down the sleeves and then it's double breasted i thought how nice would this be if you were just wearing like jeans and heels a nice top but you were going out i think this would add that like little bit extra it's really heavy it's fully lined the buttons are metal as well they're not plastic and it's got shoulder pads in it's really structured i really really like this blazer i'm actually really impressed it's a lot lot nicer than i thought it would be i don't think it would go out of place in i don't think it would look out of place in somewhere like zara for sure um yeah really loved that and i thought it'd be a nice staple piece in my wardrobe for you know going out i think as you get older you want to find things that will kind of stand the test of time and i think a blazer like this really would i actually love this blazer it's really well made um you could fasten it up if you like but i, I kind of feel too posh with the blazer fastened um but i really like this outfit actually I just put some heels on with these baggy jeans see how it's just like dressed it up a little bit um yeah i really like this really like this blazer it's perfect to keep in your wardrobe like i say just dresses the outfit up that a little bit more yeah happy with that okay guys so that is everything i got for my fashion haul i really really hope you enjoyed it i've enjoyed so much sharing everything that i got with you so if you do want to shop anything that i've shown you today i will leave it linked below and again don't forget get to use my code to save yourself some money and get yourself some vouchers so yes thank you so much for T to Timu for working with me again and there are much more videos to come from them so yeah until next time guys take care bye